You will just 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 play that little song there one more time. Happy birthday, Jesus. Come on, last week we had a healing service. God moved, manifested signs and wonders. And it's been miracle Sunday after miracle Sunday. God doing things like that. But this is the greatest miracle. Hallelujah. Come on, sir. What you waiting on? Real men follow the creator that made them. Happy birthday, Jesus. I'm so glad it's Christmas. All the tinsel and lights and the presents are nice, but the real gift is you. Happy birthday, Jesus. I'm so glad it's Christmas. All the carols and bells make this holy day swell. But it's all about you. in this video if you'll confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus Christ believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead you'll be saved Romans 10 9 come on you've been dreaming of a white Christmas your dreams have come true at Calvary where Jesus shed his blood and though your sins be red like scarlet they can be whiter than snow Isaiah 1 verses 19 he washed their robes white as snow in the blood of the Lamb, Revelation 7 and verse 14. I'm telling you, the red blood of Christ will wash your black sin soul and make it whiter than snow. Hallelujah, if you'll call on it, you can have a white Christmas, whether it snows or not, a really, really white Christmas, a really, really white happy new you, praise God, in the rest of your life. Oh yeah, happy birthday, Jesus. Jesus, I give me to you. That, sec that second track play just for a few moments. Don't you be in no hurry. Don't you be in no hurry. Holy Ghost, I thank you for what you're doing. He's forgiven sin right now, but he's still, he's still got other things he's going to do. Hallelujah. Play the track too that I gave you. That's the third one. Come on, saints, right now would be a good time. Right now, saints, would be a good time for you to give to him yourself afresh. If you're just sitting around waiting for the service to be over, you ain't really heard me preach either. You might need to come. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Wise men fell down, Matthew 2 living, and they worshiped him. Come on, you may have gave your offering and your tithe this morning, but if you gave him worship, you lifted your life to him and said, God, I'm yours. Preacher already did that. Paul said he died daily. 1 Corinthians 15 31. Hallelujah. You know, I'm a firm believer. If it looks like a dog, acts like a dog, it's probably a dog. If it acts like sheep, looks like sheep, it's probably a sheep. 
If it worships like a worshiper, come on somebody, acts like a worshiper, probably a worshiper. So don't get mad when I say stuff like that because if I look around and I just see you waiting instead of worshiping, it kind of makes me wonder if I didn't preach to you too. I serve the hang there on that cross Born to die so we could live He had the birthday we got the gift There's no way in this world we could repay The miracle he gave us on that day He was the Son God sent to one and all Put on this earth to hang there on that cross Born to die so we can live again We have the birthday, we got the gift On our Savior's birthday Yeah, we got the gift Will you receive this gift? A gift something you receive. You don't buy it. It's gave to you. You can leave the music off. We don't need none. There's a song being played to God right now. It's the sound of repentance. It's the song of surrender. People saying, forgive me, Jesus, I'm yours. My God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost says there is more to me than you know. Somebody's been wondering about that. Holy Ghost just gave you answer. Yes, there is. Something inside of you says this is something I don't know much about right here. I don't know who I'm talking to now. But deep inside of you, you feel something that's reality. God says you'll find me in altars. When I call in my house to pray, He said, if you'll come in my altar, He said, I'll show up in your life. I'll show myself to you. I'll reveal myself to you beyond your comprehension. You, you couldn't even comprehend how I could move in your life. Use this altar, says the Lord. Use it. You don't have to come up here knowing everything. Mary didn't understand everything, even about the one she'd birthed. She, she, when he'd tell her, like, my God, if he, whatever he tells you to do, just do it, John 2, 5. She said that by faith, full faith. She didn't know what he was going to say, and she didn't even understand what he had told her prior to that. But she knew he was born of a virgin. Why? Because she knew, like nobody else knew, that the baby she gave birth to had to be the Messiah because she was a virgin. She knew. So you don't have to explain God to experience God. You don't have to know everything about Him to know Him. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord God. If you'll start somewhere, you'll just believe. Come on, somebody. There's somebody here. God said, if you'll just come to my altar and begin to call on my name, I'll show you realms of me you ain't never known. And it's been in your heart. God, is there, there's, there's, is there more to you than what I know? Is there, there's got to be something different. Somebody, I don't know who y'all, but it's been just in your spirit. They, they, I, there's something more to this than what I know. The Holy Ghost said, come in my altar. Just to, I don't know what to do, preacher. Good. God can use you quicker than he can folks that think they know everything. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Matter of fact, God ain't looking for people that can come teach him. <laughs> Amen. Hallelujah. So, so, so that's who he calls. Holy Ghost. God, I give you glory. Man, I feel the presence of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Praise God Almighty. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 